call for you. Can you come out, open up the door so we can get the NITs in here? Eight nine nine five seven two nine five five. Where are you at right now? We are on the sixty five hundred block of Hampshire. Okay, I got another agency K nine with me. I told her, why don't we meet up as a group, pick a corner, and let's uh, get some KVs together and try to just do a coordinated search so we're not stepping on each other's toes. That works for you. All right, we are back. Live on patrol. Well, Sorry for that delay. We um, we just made a decision that we couldn't be broadcasting while while we were searching for the suspect. We just too risky that the suspect could monitor our transmissions about where people are, or his friends could monitor them. So we just decided that the seriousness of the incident with. Uh, 5184 Ramsey Swatch been canceled. The seriousness of the incident Thank you. required some confidentiality. Well, but we are headed back because the suspect the was arrested about five, ten minutes ago. We were the suspect was arrested and there's now they're looking for his clothing because they believe he shed his clothing while he ran. So two canines are working to get the track from where he was found to back to where the shooting was. We don't know the condition of the officer. We do believe that the suspect was also shot once. We have no idea who the shooter of that particular part was. I'm sure you will learn more from the media in the morning, but a uh, large group effort from what over a dozen different agencies probably on Pat. Yeah. Uh, Amazing work. They got a good perimeter set up quickly, and uh, they spotted him uh, trying to get out of the area with uh, his clothing slightly different. He was only in a t-shirt and gray pants, where he had been in a uh, gray sweatsuit at the time of the incident. So they are looking for those that clothing, and. Uh, Hopefully they'll find all the evidence they need. But he admitted to being the man they were looking for, in addition to him having a fresh gunshot wound. So there are going to be times like that that we just think it's too sensitive to continue broadcasting. Um, you know, probably if we were good enough, we could cut the audio, but we're not that good. Yeah, <laughs> we'll, we'll figure it out one of these days. But obviously the apprehension of an armed suspect that shot a police officer is our top priority. So we are headed back to Ramsey County. Actually, we're in Ramsey County now. Headed back to the heart of it. Trooper five to command. Minneapolis and Lionel, if you take a right on Park Trains, south of the building. Trooper 5, dispatch. There's a trooper of the helicopter. Let's find out if he's needed anymore, I assume. Or maybe he's got a heat signature, yeah. signature office of up the clothing. Closet. Someday we're going to go down to the airport and talk, to, and talk to the helicopter pilots. Can you hear Trooper 8 trying to get you on LZX? No, I cannot. Huh. Uh, Trooper 5, we're just making sure that all suspects have been located.
Kavi, 507. She should just continue. Sure, but you gotta be there all again. Copy that. We are going to clear that. Minneapolis 955. What items are we still looking for? Great Lotus sweatshirt. Is is, it, is the gun and everything else located? Did they get the gun yet or not? We don't know. So. Seems like for some reason we're not here at all. Twelve sixty four. Doesn't look like we've recovered the gun yet. So we're okay. still looking for that. As far as I can tell. So they are okay, also looking for the gun. What location were all canines meeting at? Everything was done up to Hampshire. So there's no need to really do anything east of Hampshire. So the Don't know the exact location of this, but uh, it happened somewhere in the area of 65th and Hampshire in Brooklyn Park. Well, I say your prayers for the officer at Absolutely. the hospital. I guess that's the most important thing now. Is say your prayers. I am not. There is probably enough building for the officers both sides to melt there. But what an amazing cooperative effort among all the agencies, huh? Yeah, a lot of people reacted quickly. Every other agency arriving on scene was tell us where to go. Well, where do you want us? What do you want us to do? So for you, copy. We have deputy and officers outside. Trade the one so there's two females walking. Off to the crime scene. Turn our radio frequencies back to St. Paul's frequencies, Ramsey County's frequencies, and what are you going to on the main uh, one? Two for the main. And I'll go to one on mine. One eight two. I'll take that noise complaint. Nothing, uh, by the way, nothing we have discussed here about this is of a confidential nature. It is what anybody listening to a scanner could have heard. Yeah. I mean, we don't, you know, I don't think anybody knows much. An officer was shot, the suspect was arrested. That's bottom line. Just the YouTube comments are on and they're getting crazy. We think it's because of the anonymity with which you can comment on YouTube. Hold on a second. Hey Siri, call Kyle Beasted.
copy behind 1533 Western Reserve. Yeah, our schedule is a little different because we stopped there, so our moderator usually shuts them off at when we restart. Well, clearly he didn't expect us to restart the suit. 317. I wonder why people do that on YouTube like that. I don't know. Uh, yeah, that's what I was starting to say. I think because of the anonymity. Yeah, I know for sure. But I, but even the anonymity, whatever that word is, <laughs> why just be so crass and rude? And I don't get it. I don't either. Information to squad, the message was sent to your screen again. The message was sent to your screen at 2301. Information for squads and that message was sent to your mobiles regarding the Brooklyn Park officer. Information only at 2301. 286. 286. Mobile 015. Tingle, tingle, tingle. Copy 2301. down on Rice Street again here. Fair number of cars in front of Bourne's there, huh? Yeah. A little bit surprising. This is what, 286, are you 1012 for info? Hello. 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 Inspector, the health inspector, or uh, the attorney general's office.
Sierra. Good. Could you please slow down? I can. We've got so much going on tonight. I know you guys got so much going on. I just got off work. Okay. Where do you work at? I work at Phoenix Residential. Okay. Yeah. All right. Get home safely. Kneel down by the All right. Have a good you night. Know, I'm back with the parking garage. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Thank you for being Oh, I sure hope he's okay. I spent his call. Have a good night, guys. All right, thank you. You too. You as well. Thank you. That's it. <laughs> As do you. Thank you. I appreciate it. All right. I'm tired. I feel like I look like shit. You look amazing. Thank you. Good night. You look very nice. Siri, call Rev Spence. Yes, sir. No, they, no, I'm live, but they can't hear your half of the conversation. Yeah, I don't have much more to add. Thank you. Thank you very much. All right, later. Thank you. For sure. Thank you very much. Talk to you. Bye. Bye. He's just wishing us well. That was nice. Very much so. I think uh, we can probably wait. Yeah. I don't know, you guys. Probably the viewers can start checking the media reports. The media might have more information, I'm sure, in the next half hour. Brooklyn Park will be given some kind of press conference. They'll have more information than we do. Yeah. You'll probably find out before us as to everyone's condition. Yeah. Wow. That's a beautiful house. One, two, three, one, two, nine. Two, nine. Seven hundred transfer road. Second hand inspiration of our advice. Their daughter states another the resident the is blocking there. the door and she's not able to get in. So, anyhow, we knocked this off our game a little bit. Uh, 2010. We're westbound on Maryland, coming up on Dale Street, just past Western. Go down. We got a. We haven't really been on University Avenue at all tonight. Very, very briefly. I just got to do one thing. I don't. I gotta. I just remembered one thing. I gotta do. Oh, 
Copy, 2310. 128. Where's that? Where we were just at. <laughs> this is here, caller 987 Kilburn Street. Car advising a juvenile attempted to steal a catalytic converter from a vehicle. I believe the suspect vehicle is going to be a solar Ford or a sedan. No plate information unless it's southbound on Kilburn and then eastbound on the front. Copy, Hulk. So anyhow, two of the finest okay, officers I ever worked with were Greg Lind and Andy Gould. Oh. And, um... I miss those guys. You know, <clears throat> some awesome people. And, um... Greg had asked me earlier to give a shout-out to his buddy... Three six. At 1131 Three, Virginia. Who's our roll? Is it Derek Affirmative. Jim Washington. Rayberger. Thank you. Washington, you just verified that your code yeah. 4 and your shot's fired. Greg Lynn says you're an awesome guy. We're cool for it. Wanted us to check on your house real quick. Drive by. Copy, 2312. Make sure everything's good. Oh, there he is. Nope. Jim Rayberger. Thanks for being a great person. Hey, Jim. Your buddy, Greg Lind. Thanks the world of you. Whole tone and mood of a night changes, you know. Squad two two five. Watching right now. Two two five. Not for I know you're on scene, but we had a new cop calling the email from the address, here. possibly under the influence, attempting to punch vehicles as they as they drive by. Unknown if it's the same party as your medical. Yeah, it's hard to think yeah, of it yeah, much else until we get a confirmed report on the officer's Cop. status. We know a couple people that work at Brooklyn Park and I've worked with them over the years. They're a good department. Yeah, like they're a growing department too. One of the absolute busiest suburbs in the metro. Yeah. yeah. Bravo 210. Bravo 210. Can you show me on the citizen's assist? Use uh, 360 spring. Be given a female a ride to the. Uh, 362. Safe shelter. Is that McManus? Beginning mileage is 7 3 point 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 we're not seeing anybody. There's one guy that's out here that could be a we have no description. Are you the channel one day? Copy. Yeah, you moving that to one? I didn't catch it. 970 what? Sure. I'll put this one on two. Dustin Hansen says hello. Two one four, go ahead with traffic. Right, just east of the Sears building, Alpha Juliet Foxtrot, sixty 
five. Right, just east of the Sears building at 2315. Where did you get that info? Nope. 182. 182. 314. Advise with 184 and 172. Was that 214? Happy 317. 314. Clears from the last one and put us out at. But right now it's hearsay. They haven't put anything out. It didn't come across the kid. Bravo Hotel. What what was the message on the camera? Happy Larkin turned Birmingham on an investigator at 2318. Okay. Uh, but it's just here. Okay. Yeah, well, I just. 510, go ahead with traffic. anything until we get something confirmed. So. 510, I'll go to two, sorry. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Second, no, second, second, third hand at this point. Okay. One two nine code four. One two nine code four. Twenty three eighteen. Squad five ten traffic. Five ten, go ahead. Five ten in front of uh, the good news is in this situation is the suspect's in custody. I'm five X Romeo. And um, five four one. Because the problem uh, is when someone is shot, you Copy feel like sorry, you want to do something. Three letters right? one more time. Yeah. And. And five, lacking Romeo, something to be able to do, it's just that feeling out there. Helplessness. So, is my water? Yes, sir. Uh, it felt like we were a hundred miles away instead of the what, twelve or fifteen, whatever it is. Sheriff Hutchinson was on his way out there, you know, we tried to call him, he didn't answer, but he texted saying he was on his way out to Brooklyn Park. Later we saw that. Bravo 210. As Bravo expected, two he's a good man. I'm I'll give you my mileage in a second. Thankfully, there haven't really been many funerals in the last two years. No, there haven't, thank God. Thankfully. But, been to way two, two, too five. many in 40 years. Yeah, I'm kidding. TC was unable to reach that second pump back. No answer on the phone. Copy. Uh, we can't put medics, and then, uh, we'll just clear us on for now, we can't find anybody. Copy 2320. 2320. So it's only 1120. Feels later. Oh, yeah. You know, and after that, uh, three days in a row we did on the Thanksgiving weekend, 
the week from last Friday to now seems really long. Yeah. Yeah, we don't have to do a weekday, one weekday. I think we have to do one of the daylight because so many people send us messages about liking to see their old neighborhood. Right. Feel an obligation to get out and do that. A lot of people have moved away from here. We need to get that plate. Which one? On that, uh, Impala. Yeah, the way we just went by? Yep. Yeah. It's back of the year we're looking for. That's red. That car's red. Yes, it is. Now that I can tell, it when you know I've got enough light on it. Oh, it's a Toyota. What do you think? What do I think? Is it a Toyota? Yeah. Oh yeah, it's a Rav Four. Okay. I think that was a plate on this, I'm not sure. Yeah. You hear somebody yelling? I thought I heard something. It might just be celebratory yelling. Squad 223. Well, let us know if you, if you monitor the news media. For a motor vehicle, stop to let us know what the past five minutes is from four thirty. You want to go back? Smith, yeah, I want to do. Sure People, the Silver right. Chevy Tahoe yeah. couple have played the exact same type that yeah. ran, ran into the yeah. yeah. Thank you, 2322. I know you were running the fight, but I didn't really want to take a look at it. Okay, this person we're getting rid of. That's not funny. It's hard. It's hard. It's hard when people's comments get over the line. Our assistant will be more comfortable tonight. It's time you can't have issues. <coughs> oh. Okay. If that's. Okay. This is. Uh... Is there somebody in it? I don't know. No. Was it registered to that person or was it registered? No, it comes back to a GMC terrain. I'll check the plate. I mean, oh, I'll... shoot. I got the. I got. I thought it was a Y. It's a Z. You mean a V? Yeah, it's a V. I thought it was a Y. <laughs> Duh. Doesn't have the broken tape over that right one, right? No. Somebody's out there smoking on that. Oh, I can. He's hammer, hammering that cigarette pack. You hear it? Yeah. Second hand information, 1963 University Avenue, West, number 243. Asking where we got a cigarette. Sorry, advising that she was... How you doing? Know uh, ...female in 243, male for the removed. That's not yours, is it, with the battery about to run out? That's not your car with the battery about to die, is it? Okay. 24, Council 110. 20, will join me. Copy clear. No BWC. So 117 is going to be checking the area for suspects on the 128 call. Copy 123. 25. Roger, 
sit here. I'm just going to see what the news media has to report, if anything. Can I get my case number, please? 280, case number is 262-941. Again, 262-941. Nothing there. Copy that. 2326. Can we get the new owner yet? Not yet. I'll pull it off the block. That's not going to be back for a while. We're, we're good to go. Like you said, the taillight's not broken. Well, it's surprisingly quiet in terms of shots fired now. Yes, it is. <clears throat> it's not unusual for that to happen a day or two after an officer is shot. You know, but it's unusual to happen at night when no one knows yet. Right. You know, it's just. Hey, um, you're not on live, but um, can you confirm the condi can you confirm the condition of the officer? So he's, he is going to survive, though. That's good. All right, Sheriff Hutchinson. Yeah. Yeah. 
Alright, yeah, yeah, I got you on the earphone. But thank you very much, Sheriff, for giving us the report. That's good news that he's gonna be okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks a lot. Talk again. So that was Sheriff Hutchinson. He uh, is out at the scene there and reports that the officer was apparently shot twice but is going to survive. It is in good, he said, the supervisor said he's in good spirits, considering. Awesome. And Sheriff Hutchinson's headed on his way to the hospital to get to visit with him himself. Nice. But, uh, so that's good news for everybody that um, the officer's injuries are apparently not life-threatening. They can be career-changing, we know that, right? Oh yeah. Our, from some of our friends. Definitely. But, uh, not life-threatening is the most important thing we want to hear. And of course, in this case, it does not sound like he was hit in the head. That officer that was shot in the head, of course, I mean, that's that's not life-threatening, but that's life-changing. So, but this officer is apparently in good spirits. Thank you for your prayers, and we're glad to report that he's okay. You can't get a better source than Sheriff Hutchinson. Absolutely. Well, that's good. Maybe we can concentrate a little better on what we're doing here, huh? Yeah. Your thoughts go all different directions when a brother or sister officer is injured. How's it going? Huh? We're just saying hi. Hi. How's it going? It's going well, thank you. What are you eating? My Paso. Oh. oh. <laughs> Cheeseburgers are regular. Well, 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 I thought that was you. How's it going? Thanks for recognizing me. <laughs> Beach. <laughs> Man, I got to come say hi. Can you you mind? You go ahead. You're on live. I'm going to let him walk over there. I got to come say I, hi. I know you don't want to be on live TV. <laughs> How'd you get a nice girl like that? Since sixth grade? Well, he's a good kid. He's a good kid at heart, you know? He's just got his own demons. Like everybody does. Oh, yeah. I copy your head checking your status. I'm sure that was code four. When you were nine? Thank you, 20. Good to see you, Meech. You know you're going to pay for those white patches in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you're going to pay for them in about two hours. It ain't going to wait till morning. At least if it's me. Nice to meet you, young lady. What's your first name? Ourself. You too. Have a good night. Good night. See, see you later. Man, I haven't seen him in a long time. Yeah, he lives in that house right there. I drive by. Him. Isn't that uh, Dante's house? Or it used to be. It could be. That's nice of them. So friendly, right? Yeah. He's been shot nine times. Unreal. <laughs> <laughs> that poor kid. Got nine. I think I think six of them were at one, in one incident. Yeah. Nine, nine holes. We're on Selby Avenue. Um, Eastbound on Selby, coming up on our cathedral. <laughs> I'm not going to say his name out loud, but man, I have a friend who knows everybody in town, I swear. Yeah. 
He's texting you or what? Yeah. <laughs> hey, hey. Somebody just sent us a that uh, stolen lucerne we were talking about. That's what we're looking for. Okay. Hey, don't forget tomorrow, ten o'clock, ten a.m. Another listing session to find out what you think about the sheriff's office. So, the instructions are on the county's website as to how to either phone in, zoom in. 10 a.m. tomorrow morning. Well, I guess it's, yeah, it's tomorrow morning. Saturday? Saturday morning if you want your, if you want your opinion heard. Oh, we got more, we got more people waving. Oh, who we got here today? Who we got here? Hey, how's it going? Uh, no way. How's it going? No way. <laughs> I just pulled up for a moment. I said, hey, they're coming down. He didn't go by my sisters. I said, wait a minute. We got to go say hi. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Appreciate, thank you. appreciate you guys. Thanks a lot. We follow you every weekend. Oh, thank oh, you so awesome. much. Very kind. <laughs> Good. How are you? Good to see you. <laughs> Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Thank, it's really it's kind of you to say. <laughs> we just talked to Sheriff Hutchinson. He's going to be okay. Yes. Yeah, let me do be okay. <laughs> so thank you. Thank you very much. Man. Yeah. It's... That's right when I turn around. Thank you. Oh, <laughs> you bet. We were so I'm an old East Side guy. guy. Uh, uh, my grandparents, like old German I'm immigrants grew up uh, there. I love this place. We were so excited. Well, thank you very much. I appreciate it. You guys live around here? Well, we... What's your name? Siobhan, nice to oh, meet yeah. you. Yep. And uh, now we're moving uh, over right <laughs> off Lexington and uh, right over front in the Energy Park. Thank okay. you very much. Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good spot. Now, did they, Thank you. they got rid of the restaurant here now? Yeah, so Ferns ain't here no more. Right, Ferns. You got Yumi. She uh, she worked there briefly right before COVID. And okay. Kinda, you know, that, that's that. sushi, right? Yeah, yeah it's, it's good. Is it good? It's really good. Okay. It's really good. Yeah. Really good. Got good food. We got... This is a good neighborhood here, though. I mean, you know. It is good, but it's been a... Uh, yeah, I, I mean, you're close enough that you, you know, I get, I know what you're you saying. trickle down. Yeah, you know, yeah. I, I'm out here. We got our dog. I'm out here making sure. Okay. Well, Fitzgerald's closed for a while, too, right? Or the hand... I mean, now it's the Handsome Hog. Handsome and Hog, they, yeah. And, and they just closed down, but Justin's doing good things. Handsome Hog is one of my yeah. favorite yeah. restaurants. Yeah, too. We would go there almost yeah. every day. Yeah. We went on the last day before they closed the city. Bravo 210, AOT. No. Have you ever had that whole deep fried no. red snapper? Have you? Oh yeah. <laughs> I want to try the whole pig head. <laughs> I did. I did. <laughs> we had the red snapper, but that was important. You know, yeah. acquired taste. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna try it. It looks delicious. It's good. You gotta get the cheeks. You get well. You really get so little meat off the head. It's but it's but, the good meat. It's yeah. like what the walleye cheese, man. Yeah, yeah, you're right. The back straps, you know, venison. Yep. I'm a real simple eater. <laughs> well, I would never steak get him potatoes. to be eating there you on go. a pig. Steak, head. potatoes, chicken. <laughs> my buddy Tustin. Go up on my big buddy Tustin, big tall white yeah. guy. Oh, yeah. 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 yeah He's a good friend of mine. Yeah, I know Tustin years. What's your name? I'm Aaron. Aaron? Yes, sir. Pat. Pat. Nice to meet Pat you. Pat. 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 Oh, Pat. Okay. Yep. Good to meet you, man. I was just I was just talking to Tustin on texting. I, I just I, he texted me earlier and asked what I was doing. And, yeah, now your sister isn't our sal who we were just talking to. No, is it? no, no. Oh, my okay. sister Tammy, her uh, actually her um I guess it would be her stepson, uh, Anthony. <laughs> um, he uh This is great. I love this when people flag us down. Oh, we were so excited. <laughs> How's it going? 
Bob. You are not Bob. Nice to see you. Saw me and we're like, that's why our house is so What we are doing oh, here good. right now you, you can do is it our now, main huh? goal of this whole thing. Every weekend we watch. Every single weekend. That's yeah. cool. <laughs> yeah, we're going to get out to Maplewood. Yeah, we haven't been out there yet tonight. Thank you very much. Thank you. I'm glad we did. <laughs> Derek, just tell him to go on uh, whatever well, time it was. Just, he's probably tell me right he's now. Probably he's probably saying he's us. watching right now. We were about yeah, 44 minutes <laughs> into the second live feed tonight when, yeah. when we came up here. Yeah. 44 minutes. It, it, is, it. it is testing. It is testing. He's on. Yes. He's recording <laughs> us right now. <laughs> 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 uh, I love I loved Tustin. Hey, Tammy. Tim. What is what is Cal's uh, the uh, son's name or his stepson? Uh, the the St. Paul. So you guys are moving out to Lex somewhere. We're, yeah, Anthony we're moving Brown. to the, okay, I'll call you the Burlington. Burlington, yeah. Yep. Oh, okay. Is that oh, kind of by Gabe's there or? Yeah, exactly. yeah. You yeah. Can see views you. from our little yeah. balcony. Yeah. That'd be a good it's spot. It's the same property, so we love Excelsior. Moving to Lex. Oh, they have. Okay. Nice. Decent. Well, well, I don't know if I could move else. away from a sushi place on the first no, floor. You can't do it all. Right. Here, right. Can't do it all. I hear you. Well, hear thank you. you very, very much for coming out and greeting us. It's really, it helps us to have some, all right, have some support. Take care, Siobhan. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Take care. Thank you. Likewise. Thank you. That was so cool. Very nice people. That was that was fun. Very nice. Very nice piece. Happy twenty three forty two. Happy clear. Fall. You need your cord. Well, that kind of picks you up when people are that kind, huh? Yep. That uh, I'm appreciative. I'm appreciative. That helped pull me a little bit out of the funk yeah. I was in after yeah. the off season. Yeah. 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 lucky when it comes to snow this year you know yeah really and the homeless have been really lucky I don't know 271 271 it's uh please put me out at the lair in McCubbin it just I'm amaze you sometimes that we're Copy, Blair McCubbin at 2344. Not good enough to figure out a housing solution, some warehouse or something for all the people that are out in the cold? It doesn't really seem like it should be as difficult as it apparently is. No. Seems like there's enough empty buildings around that someone could at least provide a... government could at least provide some heat, right? Mm-hmm. Keep up with all those texts, will you? Well, I'm getting them something kind of... I can't... Somebody was telling us they saw... They may have seen that Lucerne when we were up talking to Michi. Myself, 
there is our state capital for those Capitol of you Hill. that are from a different state. We challenge you to send us a picture of yours. One seven three good night. One seven three any additional. Yeah, right after uh right after we left Michi. Have a good night, twenty three. We'll see it again. Viewers are sharp, man. I'm telling you. Somebody sent us a picture of a red car, possibly that Lucerne. Squad 262. That we're looking for. 279. Two, two, we'll take a quick shot of our capital for any there new viewers. Copy 283. <clears throat> Copy squad 287. Any other squads for midnight? Excuse me, midnight EOT. What a beautiful building. Two six seven. It really is. Two six seven. Copy. Have a good night at twenty three. Minnesota State Capitol. <laughs> is there a caribou up on Rice Street up in? Uh... Two three. Yeah, on the on past Larpenter. Right. Any, uh, you need to stop there? No. TV, Somebody was asking if they knew what police incident there was. Copy it. Parking Lawson at 2347. What police incident may have been up there today? I didn't hear about anything. I didn't either. You think the homeless, let's we see if the homeless are still awake? Oh, yeah. Definitely. For the donuts? Can I get my well, I wanted to stop at the Candyland tonight too. Get some crunchy caramel corn. <laughs> 288, time of custody is 2257. Copy. 2348. Squads 214 and 225. Oh, Could we just. Called. Hang on, let's see what this one is. 225. 225. And squad 225. Clear to 1542 Marion Street, unit A as an alpha 2 for a welfare check of two small children. It looks like they are with a babysitter. Apparently, their original caretaker was taken to regions. Well, that's not good. No. Caretaker goes to Regis. Hmm. Chunks where I can't Kids are left behind. Are you sure the children are with somebody? Actually, correction, it's unknown if there is a babysitter with the children or not. Oh, hopefully. Okay. And be advised, the original address given was 1452 Marion. However, the party who gave that address may have been. Well, we uh, just got some really good news in a text here. Okay. Uh, you know that uh, 89 year old woman who's had her house vandalized repeatedly in yep. Minneapolis? Yep. They caught, uh, they caught a suspect. Good DNA or hard to say? It's Doesn't good. say. Thank you for sharing that. That's very good news. Let's see what's happening here. So she's just dropping them off for the, for the train. Yep. Getting a lot of pictures of some state capitals. By the way, I think we're still looking for Lola. I wish I had better news on Lola. That's sad. Just, I don't have anything to add, but just keep your eye out for Lola. Still over there. Minneapolis, Coon Rapids. 
Saint Anthony area. CPD, Acker and Jackson. Copy it, Acker and Jackson at 2350. I just don't know. I just don't know. I hate to wake people up to get donuts. Yeah. Let's see if anybody's awake. Had a fire here the other day. A number of tents, I guess, were lost. Well, they did. Yeah. Okay. I heard somebody. Uh, it seems like everybody settled down. Looks like it. And you know, the thing is, if you yell donuts, people feel obligated to come and get some. And might not even want them, you know. And This guy wants a box of donuts. Can I ask him? Hi, are you staying here by any chance? Are you staying here by any chance? Want some donuts? I think he had Hello? headphones in. Want some donuts? Sure. Well, it's all right. Can you handle a box of them? Can you handle a whole box? Very good. Well, that's good. Two happy customers. 119, cancel them. I'll take that. Couple happy customers, huh? Yeah. 223. Okay. I'm up to the other end. Well, it's staying around, so he's good for Say, yeah. Man had a big smile on his face. Huh? Yeah, he did. I guess the one on Mounds is still going too. That you know, one I don't think is sanctioned by the city. Mm. Two two one looks like two one three is already en route. Uh, you city. can keep clear unless you'd like to still be en route as well. Guys, give us a while. We're a little closer. Green laser on the screen here. That right in front of us. What's up there? The, there was a green laser on the street. Hmm. Remember, we've seen it before at the other yeah. end. Yeah. And those green lasers can blind you. Yeah, they can. Right there on the street. I'm sure it was probably on the video too. It's in this left lane right here in the green circles. Looked like it was coming from behind us, or could you tell? I'm guessing behind us, yeah. Remember, we saw it down at the other end? Yeah. So, it's like coming from your friend's balcony. Mm -hmm. So, if someone wanted to drop some things off here. The best way is just to come to where those benches are. Yeah, during the daytime. Yeah, come during the daytime if you want to donate to this encampment here. Or call Amber. Well, you can message Pat. Pat has Amber's number from our department. Right? Yeah, go ahead Go ahead and message me. and uh, He'll give you Pat Amber's number. You can call Amber. She's our coordinator. Yeah, message uh, me through and Facebook. Update for squads, two and I'll get her. Two, two, one. Looks like get you caller states another vehicle pulled up to the driveway. Silver Buick, Mike Echo Hotel, 093. 
looks like as of a few minutes, correction, a few seconds ago, vehicles are now driving from Deuceman Street eastbound towards downtown St. Paul. Where's that at? Dousman, that's... 2355. 7th of Dousman, that's almost 7th, right? Is that the... Let's just get... Is this... Yeah. Who knows? You want to give this guy a box of donuts? Is that the same girl? Did you just get a donut from us? Yeah. Probably. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I did. All right. I do have good night, 2356. What's that? Well, just as a matter of fact, good. It's fully leaded, though. It's a Winston. Oh, somebody donated them. Oh, what? The pan, yeah. What does that mean? That means it's strong. If we don't get rid of them, we're gonna eat them all. All right. That's the white cap. Yeah, but I don't really want to wake everybody up just to give them to them. So. What about the one down off of off of Kellogg there? There's that little one down by Jackson. That right down here? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I think everybody's kind of asleep. We yeah. got rid of two box, three boxes tonight. I'm not going to push them on the people. No, no. No. That's... Just put them on the bench. <laughs> yeah. I hate to do that. Yeah. Well, we'll figure something out. Thank, thanks for stopping yeah. again. Appreciate it. Thanks a lot. Yep. Thank you. Let's see if we can get that coming here. That's the silver Chevy Tahoe. Coming in on seventh from, uh, uh, from like St. Clair area. Okay, I think that's where Dalsman is. Yeah, it is. What's the particulars of the call? Just so I... Auto theft. Oh, it's an auto theft. Yep. Oh. Happened in Fort Worth. Thirty-three South Smith. All right, there's a silver Buick and a silver Chevy Tahoe. Unsure which one is the stolen right now. Clear. Something. Uh, uh, like not a Buick. We're looking for a towel and a Buick. Yep. I'm sorry to confirm. It looks like the vehicle is still at the address. Linda, do you want to take out your address? Linda, do you want to put yours on the Do you need the air this time? The problem is the Right. Probably 2359. I believe it's the Tahoe that was taken. That's our best guess. Four zero five. It's not a Tahoe. One zero five. Okay, five minutes Central ago, a squad here. saw it at three zero seven Michigan, which is right at St. Clair and Seventh. One zero two. The Tahoe. Yeah, go ahead. Thank you. I'm going to put this one on two. One, three, two. Crash one, two, three. One, two, three. What's the plate we're looking for? I'll be clear, she's just um, cast one, three, two. It is six Bravo Hotel three six three. I'm checking to see if it's Minnesota. Minnesota. Sounds like squads might actually be out with the vehicle on Michigan. Oh, Michigan. Yeah. Yeah.
after the squad's out with the stolen. Eight friends are checking if it's occupied. I'm going to check on their status. Control where vehicle for her, thank you. Copy, code for it, one minute. The blue lasers are even worse than the green now. Really? Yeah. Somebody's saying in Portland, they had some someone driving around town just shining them into random people's faces as they were driving down the road. Everybody's in a hurry. Yeah. Those look like. Those look like, kind of like street racing. I think types. they probably were. Information for squads, channels two and three are patched for a short break at two minutes. That's good. The problem is, there's so many people in a hurry now, you can't tell. Yeah. If they're just the driving like their normal selves, or if they're driving to get away from something. Right. So we're up on Grand Avenue at Dale Street, about to head west on Grand. Great little neighborhood. Squad 366. Let's keep it that way. 366. Via 2 1032 Orange Avenue East on a DOC for a party named Mercy causing issues at the address. Thank you for a minute. What, did you do anything exciting in the last week? Ah, uh, I was in the office every day um, until today. Got my uh, exercise bike put together, my nephew Jack came over today and I opened up and I looked at the instructions. Yeah. Well, you said you were And gonna and I got uh, anxiety looking at the instructions. Yeah. He came over and put this thing together like he was a aeronautical engineer or something. Well, that's nice of him. Yeah. You know if you ever Squad 320 copy and route to the suspicious 2112 Lower Afton Road for a party screaming so, nearby possibly from the woods. Squad 323, can you assist? Jim Moody is the best. You know? Oh, that's right. Jim Moody. Sure. He can put anything together. Thank you, five minutes. Jim Moody is one of my, well, he is my primary assistant in the sheriff's office there. Administrative assistant. He is a man of all trades. I think they may have gotten the inspiration for MacGyver from him. Light is not turning green. This car that went by is in a little bit of a hurry. Victoria is just not a like a heavy route that most people use. It's a covert route. Yes, I use the wonderful gift I got from Bob every time I lay down to take a nap or when I go to sleep. And I've been waking up feeling better in the morning than I, 
I have in months. This one. Yeah. This one, okay. So. This is kind of the way I would go from Grand to. Well, if you know your way around. But yeah. you notice how he stalled there and he wasn't sure if he was supposed to turn down here, right? No, there was a guy crossing. Oh, there was. A citizen? Yeah. It's just the way you are. You just. Oh, but he ran through that stuff. Yeah. So. <laughs> I guess you could argue. I could have a little chat with him. Yeah. <laughs> Did it again. <laughs> we don't get down here very often, anyhow. I'm pretty soon we're going to be back where that, where that stolen is. Where yeah. We're right just about there. Copy 10 minutes. Delta Bravo. Something zero something. Zero two six was the end. Why would that car pull out in front of him like that? It's almost like he's slowing him down for us. <laughs> <laughs> Delta Bravo 026. Just let you have your golden tongue chat with them here. Sure. What kind of car is that? That is a Corolla. Toyota Corolla. Yeah, they start teaching me these different characters. Hi. Hi. How are you? Would you please, so that your insurance doesn't go way up getting tickets, yes, and so that we don't have to divert from other more important things, would you start stopping at the stop signs? Yes, sir. I do apologize. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> Thanks, See you later. Have a good night. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> she had a well, look on her face like she was going to put that light right in her yeah, eyes. <laughs> She was one of those people, though. She had a smile that you couldn't yeah. help but smile no, yourself. No, I know. She, she was... See, the, the initial five to ten seconds of police-citizen contact is always tense. Yep. Okay, because you're not sure what type of police officer you're getting. And, you know, there are different styles. I mean, some, you know, some are just going to give you a ticket and say nothing. Some are going to chew you out and give you a warning, right? Right. Some are just going to be like Father Pat, which is, you know, my style. And, um, but you never know. And as a citizen, you know what they're thinking. Do I admit that I did something wrong? Or do I <laughs> claim I didn't know I did that? <laughs> what level of admission will get me the least sanction? A little bit of admission? A lot of admission? Or what? So... And um, there's no one rule to that either. So if I could tell you what that best strategy was, I would. But it's just a lot of different personalities on the street, a lot of different personalities in police work. But police officers I do appreciate genuineness. So let's go to Highland Park to see if we can find any burglars out there. It's really, since, you know, several departments there have kind of cracked down out there really gotten better. So I just want you to know I feel guilty that we don't get to your messages. We're going to try to get better and find a way to do that, but it's just, uh, I mean, I'll get hundreds of messages. 
in a half hour. So, mm -hmm. You know, I ought to finish up the uh, weekly notable crimes. Yeah. While we're out here in the island. And I'm going to finish up a box of donuts. <laughs> At least a couple. I think. I, did you give away that box of those jelly-filled uh, Bismarcks? Um, I didn't look as to what I gave away. Okay. I may have. Okay. So we're hearing that the camera's freezing up a little bit, but I think that was we were in a little bit of a dead spot down there. Now it's kind of there. We go. Looks like it's back up. Squad two one three. Two one three. 727 Virginia Street for noise complaints of a loud party inside the house. Thank you, 12 minutes. So on uh, December 5th at about 11 at night, at Wheelock and Arcade, officers uh, spotted a stolen vehicle and tried to stop it. It fled from them. Uh, stop sticks were deployed, but the vehicle avoided hitting them. Uh, Ramsey County deputies located the stolen a short time later. This is depressing. A 12-year-old driver was detained. Four passengers fled on foot. They caught them. I think there was they a caught car them. I don't and, know if it says that in yep. there. Three of the passengers were juveniles. One of the one of the passengers had ammunition in his pocket, and they found a handgun a short distance away. Yeah, they found a gun thrown out. Somebody was asking about this too on uh, on Saturday, and I can't remember whether it was an Amazon or a FedEx truck was uh, robbed, carjacked. They recovered it and they uh, did arrest one suspect. And then the following day on Sunday, an Amazon driver at Front and Albemarle was dropping off a package when he noticed his van was moving. He jumped into the van and confronted the driver who pulled a gun on him. And they uh, forced him out of the van took off with the Amazon truck and it was found a short time later in an alley a very short distance away and it had already been emptied of all its packages. Oh my goodness. That was, uh, there was a van that was a suspect vehicle that uh, was working in conjunction with the robber. So they no doubt backed the van up to the Amazon truck and within a couple of minutes had it emptied out. Is that a lizard? I'm not sure. Could be. Uh, let me find the plate again. It was red. Yep. folks the defrost is not on uh, we have gotten in the habit of keeping it a little chilly inside the car here 
It's just occasionally uh, we are in a dead spot for cell reception. We uh, cannot uh, control that. Now this is a, about the third or fourth time I was asked this. Uh, no, I did never. I never worked for Edina Police Department. However, there was an officer, Pat Scott, in the at least the seven, 70s and 80s, who did work for Edina. Uh, Six fifteen geranium for DOC for four to five parties yelling at each other outside the building. Thank you, 17 minutes. Get back to those. Uh... You just had to do a suspicious car call up here. Supposedly the car is at the left, but. Where was that at? Avon uh, and Eichelhardt. Well, he might even have them up there. Oh, that Avon and Eichelhardt, there's been several shootings right there. Yeah, there At that intersection, it's been a shots fired hot spot for some time. X-ray Papa nine two three. It's the address there. Get your radio off. Seven ninety seven. Twenty for hundred. Twenty for hundred. Twenty for hundred. We're out at uh, 797 Eichelhart with Bravo X-Ray Papa 923. It's unoccupied, but in the middle of the road. It's in relation to that Avon and Eichelhart call. Uh, 119, that white car from the Avon Eichelhart call is GOA. Uh, put me out on that other car. I think so. Okay. 
Thank you. That's Ganzel over there. Oh! Hey, what's happening? Not much. We are on live, which you probably do. Yeah, I've got my, I got my camera on too. Yeah. <laughs> Same car. They were looking for that other yeah. one, the white car. Yeah. And, uh, but I think he was checking on tour that way. That way, you can always, you can always tow it, but they might come and move it. Just you guys tonight? It's close enough, huh? Just you guys out here tonight? Or no? Well, Wiss was out here for a while. Out here for a while? Yeah. Still out here? Mikey Martin, you know, we went up to Brooklyn Park for that officer yeah, shooting. I, just, I guess he's going to be okay, yeah. We just heard from Sheriff Hutchinson that he's going to be okay. That was a, yeah, it's a scary deal. Yeah, my wife's in Anoka now working up there. She thinks people are sitting in Anoka. It's not good. Well, we haven't had one for a while, you know. I mean, no, we don't need them. I know. Hey, it's always great to see you. Where's your partner tonight? Uh, he's, I don't know, we're split up tonight. So oh. I want to do it some other stuff. <laughs> Tell him we said hi. Right, Have a good one. Thanks. Who's his partner? Oh, yeah, yeah. I know. I know who that is. Usually down there on 7th Street, those guys. We're clear before he disposes that. 2400, we're clear. That's on one, so I'm going to put this one on three. <clears throat> From the constant mom, who's only able to contact her through Facebook Messenger. Advise the DK boyfriend is there, wants him to be removed. Marcus Hicks, black male, 43, 6, 1 average build. Not physical, just verbal. Copy. At 26 minutes. So if we send that other phone home with you during a week, will you answer all those answers? <laughs> it's okay. That's okay. Oh my goodness.
feel I feel guilt ridden. You know, I I remember all the cases that I in my career that I didn't feel like I had solved. Right. So now I got five hundred messages I haven't answered. You know, it's, just, it's the same. <laughs> <laughs> Late, is it? What time is it? It's really not. Uh, it is 12 30. Brief moment with our speed demon Mustang. You know, it's not listed on there on the notable crimes that I'm going to get back to in a minute. But this past Sunday, a friend of mine was coming home from a job. And he lives over off of uh, Orange uh, on the east side. Yep. And it, I want to say it was at Mendota and Hawthorne. He was driving up and saw a guy underneath a car. And his immediate thought was that this guy was taking the catalytic converter. Yep. So he got his camera phone ready to take a picture. And as he drove up, the guy came out from under the car, sure enough, with the catalytic converter and all the tools in his hands, got into his car, and then noticed he was being filmed and fired three shots at my friend. That is not good. He had a beautiful picture of the car, though. Oh, I saw, yeah, you showed me that. That's, it's a miracle he didn't get hit. It really is. But, uh, yeah, Avenue. Order is right. the father for Charlie is pounding on the door. Order is right. There's no contact order in place. Suspect is going to be a Marlon Montgomery. Wearing a white shirt and blue pants. White shirt and blue pants. What number's on? 468. Four, 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 Tom. 23 in a block. Shoot, we're there. 423, clear of blocks. Address 116. 110. Arundel is 440. Yeah. So we'll see the three four doors down. Just gonna do the low key thing here. You can clear this at five. Motion lighting back. Huge marks for one seven five. Squad just said they're in the rear. Thirty minutes. Let's sit here and see what happens. That's four five eight, so it's got to be a house down there to the west. Three one two four. It looks like he has a Mack truck pickup as well. He ran from the officers last time. Three one four. Oh, it looks like it's going to be a domestic abuse. Three one four. Try a call back. Call Vermont. 110. 110. Where did the caller say he was? Verify with the TCU that stated that he was knocking on the door.
copper there. Jump said that he ran in the alley. One ten, I copy those. Another car meal, he ran into the alley at 32 minutes. Five foot nine, hundred and seventy pounds. Does he have a car? That's what we need to know from her. Three one five DOT. Three one five. How's yours look? Okay. Looks good. I'm sure, they're gonna ask him if he's got a car. see him at the holiday. <laughs> <laughs> well, he ran on foot last time. I'm guessing he's... But do you think he runs on foot all the way or just to a car? I'm thinking he's crashing at some buddy's house in the neighborhood. Just for our friends, what's our code for? Yeah, we're good, thank you. Copy, 34 minutes. There's a guy across the park going the wrong way. Very clever tactic. <laughs> Is that a one? So we're looking for a domestic protection order violator that was pounding on the door. He's got several warrants for him. He was here four days ago and ran as well. And um, now he came back. I don't know why people do that. Sense. No. Does it doesn't. I mean, be banging the door with you. Probably right, Patrick. You probably ditched into a house a couple blocks away. Yeah. You think she might know that who that would be, though? You think? 
everyone's having a good night. Yes, sir, you're not on live, you're just on my call. You got 314. You. We copy the update. Yeah. Great news. for that report, Sheriff. We appreciate it. We appreciate that. Thank you very much. Thank you. Bye. 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 That was Sheriff Hutchinson calling back again. Just let us know he visited with the uh, injured officers at, at the hospital. Said he was in good spirits. Appreciates everybody's prayers. And um, he pointed out how many different departments were there as well as we were talking about earlier. How people just rallied and showed up. So that's all good. That's very good news. Yeah. Well, it doesn't look like we're going to be able to catch this guy, huh? No. Something tells me he's not done for the night. Happy yeah. 1505 Westminster at 39 minutes. Well, now that we've confirmed that, let's what we got there? let's talk about the lighter side of life. Morning, two. Morning, two. Courtesy ride, two females to 401 Sibley, mileage of 71. Do we know what this, we, is this gentleman we're looking for, Mexican or what? How you doing? Yeah, 40 minutes. Well, he said he was five nine, but I didn't know his description. Five nine, one seventy. How's it going? Blackmail, but Marlo Montgomery. How tall was that guy? Uh, a little taller. Uh, I'm not sure. Well, they just Park passed. First call. Probably about right. <laughs> but you'd think they'd have said shaved head. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah.
a lot of street up there. Ooh, that didn't sound too good. Well, that's a pretty unusual name. So I think this is actually going to be him. So I don't think that's all right. Yeah, he looks Hispanic. That's what I thought for some reason he was a Hispanic male. Marlo Montgomery. This is ass this guy. What he's up to it. He's walking down the street. Go on, Mr. Ford. Go on, can I get my hand? Not those two. <laughs> <laughs> Much more hand is going to be <laughs> zero seven three. He dipped in somewhere. Have a nice Less busy than last Friday, just in terms of everything. I yeah. don't know if I'm imagining it or if it's just oh, the, definitely. the shutdown, the colder weather. <clears throat> we got a hot sheet in the car. Pat's checking it like a wild man today. <laughs> But there hasn't been a pursuit of a stolen. Mm -hmm. Maybe maybe the tide is turning. I'm not that optimistic. But <laughs> Always look for the silver lining. So this car came off of University Avenue. Oh, high priority. Get to White Castle. <laughs> priority. How's it going? What do you think? Cheeseburgers or hamburgers? Breakfast sandwich. Breakfast sandwich? Smart man. Smart man. Breakfast sandwich. Very good. That's the way to go. That's the way to go. You have a good day, buddy. You too. See ya. Thank hey, you. What's that, what's that website? Which one? That y'all's on. Live on patrol. Live on patrol. Live on patrol. YouTube. Go to YouTube. I gotta get, my YouTube's fucked up on my phone, but I, I've been trying Facebook. to find it. Facebook. Facebook, too. All right. But live on patrol. I got you. You're on it, man. You're on be it. safe, man. Because y'all some OGs. God man. bless. Thank you. Take Thank care, you. man. Thank you. Well, there we have it. Following a car to the White Castle. The gentleman watches us on YouTube. <laughs> I love it. The biggest compliment, he says, we're also original OGs. Morning, <laughs> too. OG Popo. Four out, the mileage is 74. Okay, I'm pretty
if uh, there's a gas station over? Yeah, if it's still open, I, I need to make a brief stop. Yeah. <laughs> Female three has left. Remember to say white female thirty five five eight. Can you grab me a cherry pie? Christian, I know clothing oh, yeah. description should be on the butt. Of course. Because I'm feeling famished. <laughs> One two nine. One two nine. Copy of forty seven minutes. How you doing? How's it going? We're just rolling too. Exactly. Have a good one. One ten. You can show us clear. Cancel sixteen. Two calls in West. There's two calls in West. Okay. One ten. One ten. Caller advising there are two male parties that are physically fighting inside of the address, stating that one is bleeding and then disconnected when it's Well, I don't, I don't have it, so. Pretty minutes. That's, that's all. Okay. says all I've got is male cops said it's physical. <coughs> and was that the same call as where they said somebody was bleeding? I think so. But there's another call to Days End too. So. I didn't get that. out of the car briefly assisting the St. Paul officers while they get the scene controlled.
So we're going to move the car over a little bit. There is a man inside with some serious injuries. Another party with some blood on him. Medics are on the route and the way to get here. So we're just going to stand by until the medics show up. One ten medic can come in. They can come from the back. Copy fifty five minutes. I didn't hear if we said it already, but we're close for for medic. Copy. 55 minutes. What's that? I'm surprised the medics aren't here yet. Oh, the copters in the kitchen said for them to stage. Oh, they did? Yeah, while they were trying to get the one guy out of the bathroom. Oh, okay. One, two, three. Go ahead, go one, two, three. Just verify it's going to be four. As of now, yes, go for it. 
Didn't look too good laying there on the floor for starters, did he? No, at first I thought it was a. I thought he was in trouble, but they said it's just some bleeding from his mouth. <coughs> Inspector is gone. What uh, I left when he came out there? What was uh, was there? Was what was the nature of the fight? Did they say no, nope. Interrupt. Everybody seemed to. Copy four nineteen Sherburn Avenue. Caller advising a SUV with a trailer backed up to the construction site appeared to take items and left on a run towards University. Has it David? Copy. This alarm kept going off over here. Mm. I'm sorry. Oh, that's all right. <laughs> 24, let medics know that they're one street south of us. What did he say? They're one street south of So the medics are going to be pulling up here in a minute. Yeah. All right. We will get out of the way. Check out that Sherman address that just came out. Yeah. Let's see if he's coming down this way first. Sure. Suburban with a trailer, it says. SUV with a trailer. What the hell? I mean, the problem is so many of these calls are. Five minutes old by the time we get right. Maybe he'll come back <laughs> for another load. Well, he can only turn right from where I'm going. Mm -hmm. Traffic. It's not all that cold, but it's really humid cold. Yeah, with them and it's snowing in Cordia. Copy. Let's get this back. Let's go 
squat here? Yeah, it looks like there's a squat in the back. Oh, okay. Or is it? I don't know. I think you're right yeah, that's a squat. That's a bummer. Well, can't be too far away. I think just fists. Down for the count. Said he was sleeping when it happened. That'd be kind of a pretty... The that's quite the sucker punch if you beat somebody up when they're sleeping. You might have been sleepwalking. <laughs> Caused by alcohol. You make me laugh a lot. I don't know if you're extremely funny it's just or I'm easily it's just amused. Late. It's, late. it's just late. It's like I told Chief Thomas, sir. Chief, it sure seems funny. At four in the morning. <laughs> if you don't find a way to find some humor on this job, occasionally you go crazy. Please be open. No, 
otherwise M&H. Squad 303. Reliable M&H. 303. I guess we're going to M&H. Show me back. Yep. Copy 107. And I know they had chocolate Twinkies I last year. I think that's where we got them. Yep. Original CN with 300, 910. First squad, Tino's morning, sir. Pressure, break at 107. Well, I think give it another yeah, hour, yeah, 2 o'clock, Pat, and see what happens. Sure. We're up, we're up, we're up, too. Sounds like a plan. Not a ton of stuff going on, but... You ever have one of those deep fried Twinkies or deep fried candy bars? That's a fair. Yeah. You know, I had a I bite. Never have. I, don't I had a bite out of one, and it was just, it was too much. Yeah, that's exactly right. You just shouldn't try to ruin perfection. <laughs> I knew you were. I knew I mean, you were going to say exactly to, that. This can't. Squad two eighty. Two eighty. People are always trying to. We clear report. Thank you. Sign me a admin CM. Air that over there. Sometimes it can't be done. Copy what right. address do you like to use? We use 367 growth. I mean, it's like a good steak is a great steak. You don't have to put something fancy on the top. Your admin CN is 263095. Again, 263095. Copy, thank you. You're welcome, 109. I did have some Chick-fil-A today for the first time. Probably a lot of people have had Chick-fil-A. I never have. But my wife and son, they're big fans of it. We were driving around and they asked me to go there, so it was pretty tasty. Was it? Yeah. What you, did you have the sandwich? No, I get these little... Like chicken tenders? Yeah, they, I guess the chicken. sauce is what makes it special. You know, the Chick-fil-A sauce. It's, Oh, they serve waffle fries there too. There's the bonus of it. Okay. Waffle fries instead of regular fries. All right. Sixteen eight zero six. Still show that uh, stop at the barbecue used to open. I guess they make different open. size chicken tenders, but they like told me to get the smaller ones. Like big tender. Chick Fil A, I'd give them a good grade. Canes a couple times. Go there at all? No, but I had it once when uh, when we were still doing the payday Friday. Yeah. Thing at the sheriff's office. Yeah. I had them there. That, that was pretty good. Yeah, the only thing once in a while it's a little undercooked. That's the only concern I have. <coughs> but I suppose every store is a little different. on one of the foodie Facebook pages. Yeah. I made some guy really mad at me last week. I didn't mean to, but somebody was asking about the best fried chicken around. Yeah. And he said, uh, Chick-fil-A. Yeah. And I said, well, yeah, if you like chicken tenders. And he got infuriated. Because 
because <laughs> do they do they sell the regular chicken like can no I, can you can't get chicken? like a bone in piece Washington of chicken line. there and Washington. that's what I like and I'm, yeah, well, that was my point well that Kentucky fried chicken is still one of my oh. favorite meals Kentucky and Fried Chicken, chicken Original Recipe. Hang on. 1611 Fremont Avenue, Thompson Heath, <coughs> Meth, has history of cutting herself and threatening self harm today and not violent towards others. Don't forget the Twinkies. Medics will be en route and staging. Be right back. 323 copies. How's it going, Sarge? 320 from Fremont Avenue, How are you? I thought you were a commander by now. 320 copy. I like twice. that. Not yet. The pump just did that by. <laughs> the female stating, stating that she's not going. Pat's going to get us something to eat. We are on live now. What's your regular job now? <laughs> We're just about to back in the West Boston to copy from assault occurred at University in Victoria. Cop was stabbed in the face 20 minutes ago. Unknown suspect whereabouts. Suspect, excuse me, suspect is an Asian male, 21 years old, wearing all black, had an ice pick. Stabbed with an ice pick. That's not good. 182 in route. Huh? Thank you. Thank you, 113. Behind me? One twenty. Copy. One sixteen. Along with one eight two, you both can be clear. Oh, we were, we talk to people all the time, but no. Good day, thanks. Oh, one eight two copy. Oh. One thirteen. Huh? Good. Good. There's not much going on tonight, but okay to that. It's all good. You know. I mean, I need some nourishment. Oh. Now, where did you say you're working? You're not. Gee, that's what I thought. Yeah, that's all good. Yeah, I thought you were up there. You're. Who else is up there now? Who do? Who are all the chiefs? Thomas, sir, Murphy, Copel, still there? Speedman. And then who are the execs like you? Uh, Ernie's still up there. Uh, let's see, that's not, that's not his style. Yeah. Yeah. Cruz? Yeah, I don't, I don't really know them. I know who I've met her. He did. Good kid. Good. Is that an off-duty squad or what? Where where all those lines come from on the car? Twenty-nine. It's a sharp car though. It's twenty-nine. I'm clear. I just wonder where all those lines come. Is that from being in the heat or what? Call by. Happy, thank you. Area check, 1440 yeah. Randolph at 115. Those aren't scrapes, right? Does heat cracks or what? It must be, because this is a sticker. Yeah, you know, the whole oh, it isn't a white door. It's not a white door. Copy the uni syndicate, courtesy ride at 115. I thought they just left it unpainted. So you can replace that. Yeah. That's good. 113. 113. We're out of Union Victoria. We're not located. Okay, he wasn't trying to get a better location, please. Copy. <laughs> I, thought, I thought I had heard uh, Whistler on there. Oh, he was here, yeah. He was driving around. He wasn't with us. He was. Uh, he that's left. What I, yeah, that's what I meant by that, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Mike was here. What's he yeah. got for you here? Huh? Can you some of these broccoli? Yeah. Celery? What do you, what do you got? Well, we're, go we're, we're shooting for chocolate Twinkies. We'll see what we came up with here. But the best. Nothing, nothing but the best for you two. I think I got a fresh. I think I got a fresh Mountain Dew back here too in the back. <laughs> hey, Rod, how often do you work here? Uh, 
Sometimes on Wednesdays, but, but sometimes we're not on the air. You know, sometimes we just go out and drive around. You know. Yeah. We were out there because of all those burglars they had out west there, you know. Yeah. Yeah. We were we tried to help you guys out, whatever we could do. <laughs> all right. Thank you. We're going to go east. Call us if you need us. See you, Rats. That's it. Well, you did good, Pat. Jesus Christ, me. look at these things. You did good. <laughs> they have fudge covered ones now. And that is an example of what we were talking about for the deep fried stuff. Too, too much. much. Too much. Too yeah. much. One thirteen update. You see here snoring sounds in the background. Cops may have passed out. Well, there you go. Call the police. You pass out while you're on the phone, and the, te the telecommunicator can hear your snore. <laughs> That's got to go with the history. <laughs> That's a classic. Yeah, if you have to call the police, it's a good idea to try and stay awake while on the phone with them. Six, 
3540 Edgerton Street, assisting medics. Uh, 59 year old male, not conscious, not breathing. I don't want to put all these details on. Five foot two, 13 years old. 2360, Captain. 2360, Hey, Chase. What's going on, buddy? 314, you're out where? Just come and talk to us. We don't want to chase you, but tell us what's going on. Tell us what's happening, man. Uh, call on free. Well, are you headed home or not? You, you want to take a couple donuts in with you? 113, you can cancel another. Yeah. Want to take some donuts in with you? We got a box of donuts in the back. We got, we got a whole box. Hey, by the way, you got the PlayStation shirt on, okay? Yeah, I got a question for you. Do you know how to play PlayStation? Yes. You got a four, or what do you got? Yes. Now, the fives, I guess, are really hard to get. Are people stealing them, or what? I don't know. So I can't get, my friends are telling me they can't even get a five anywhere. $2,500. Sold out. Yeah, sold out. What the heck? Who sells Who sells out? That's a, hey, jump in the back here. Keep what yourself heck? warm. Here. Huh? Hey, hey, listen, what's going on with you and your mom? Nothing. Correct. Tussle with my brother. Tussle with your brother? Hello. Hi. Everything okay? I want to get out for a minute, roll that window up so we don't do too much. Yep. This is 321 and 329. I don't, want, I don't want this. They talk shit about your budget, but you do your work. Well, thank you for saying that. I'm going to get you guys to break from writing. Reference an assault, 798 Orange Avenue East. Comp went to the house. So Bob's out of the car here talking to Mom. He was pushed. He is not injured. And uh, we don't want to uh, invade Blackmail, their privacy Street, too much. So. We're going to keep that conversation private. Unknown clothing description, there were three people in the home at the time. Three to nine, copy. Three to one, I copy. Well, that's a metaphor. But yeah, and this really young man like did this. absolutely yeah. nothing wrong. I mean, you want, you want another kid? Uh, stealing a car and hijacking people and all that shit. You want you want us to kick their ass at home first, right? Well, I don't want you to kick their ass. Six three one seven two years old. I am sure. Six three one copy. My son is Kane. Seven eight eight. Twenty one sixty school squad zone. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Copy. I see this dude all the fucking time. Okay? <laughs> all right, great, great to see you. No, but thank you, though. No, I'm just saying it's like, if we don't take your own fucking kids at home, that's the reason why so many of them are dying at a young age. And they're out here fucking stealing cars, hijacking. We don't want that. You know what I mean? 
We don't want no. that anymore. So I, listen, this is my last of six sons. You've done good. He's the last one. You know what I mean? Yep. Like about 300. Seen him try to disrespect I got it. I got it. He just put his foot in his ass. Yeah. Yeah. Three, three, 300 is close enough. You know? But then the crazy part is we got a house full of kids here having a Christmas party. Yeah. But my grandkids, he's really good. 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 Affirmative. And just wanted to make sure 300 copied the gun pointing incident. Yeah. All right. All right. Oh, we already. Oh, oh listen. I'm gonna pack. I had to fucking. We making Sundays right now. Okay. Good. All right. Thank I you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Not bloodshed. Page no longer on screen. Have a good night. Thank you. Thank you. Affirmative 631. She told the TC that she no longer wants to speak with officers. We tried to get her back on the line to convince her to see officers. Said she's driving home and it's disconnected. Are we satisfied with the way that one rolled out? Yeah. Yeah, we're okay. Uh, It's all good. Oh, yeah. He just said he had an argument with his brother. You're on board. You're on board. It's a small world. Why don't you let uh, 321 and 329 go back to writing? We'll go from this wallet up there with. I definitely knew her back in the day working Frog Town. Coming back all night. Three two nine copy. Thank you. Okay, thanks. Three two nine copy. You can cancel two one four. I'll call Canada. Three two nine copy. I don't know. I think it's all fine. Yeah. Yeah. Basically. Three two one four. Okay, she's getting ready to do a missing report, which is yep. not the case. <coughs> Twenty four hundred. We went to eight sixty one. Burr. Child was returning home on his own. We talked to the mother and can market assisted. Looks good. endorse the concept of kicking someone's ass, just for the record, right? No, we do not. We do not. But we do believe that the number one way to help raise healthy children is to have involved parents. Absolutely. Concerned and involved parents.
Very close. Black males and one black female, northbound in the alley towards How's it going? 320. I don't know. There is a female there. One of the three was a female. Captain Cook, four for medics at 3 and 300 Hi. Everything okay? Yeah. All right. Just wait for a friend. Lives right here? Yeah. Okay. They're coming out right now. All right. Have a good night, guys.
guys didn't look too honest to me. <laughs> you're, you're overly kind to that bear. <laughs> Coming out with the everything she stole from the alley. <laughs> <laughs> Waiting for her to come out with the TV from in that house. Uh, Delta Mike Lima 618. GMC on board, silver. One occupant. Okay. We ought to be able to GOA this one, huh? There it is. 2,500. Tell me where to go. Nothing here. I mean, 2,500. This one, this one here. Yeah. Negative response on the fence speaker. They can run through that. Everything. They're on there. They're on there somewhere. Somewhere they're out here still. Yeah, I'll throw. Oh, there we go. 1300. On behalf of Bowling Green, please for a welfare check slash PIC call for a female named Michaela. Made this three two one. Is that an apartment complex three, two, again at thirteen hundred Wilson? I believe so. Spoke with the complainant. She yeah. stated that there was never a gun involved, and she didn't want her help. Can you change it to suspicious? Clear advised with K nine three one four and three eight three three two nine. Copy at 140. So we're running over there because it's busy. 631, can you send me 314 is called? 213. 631, copy of Shoyan Route at 140. Yeah, Wilson's formerly senior hire, is it? Right? Seems to be picking up a bit. They've got a number of pending calls over here. I guess we should tell people where we are. We've done a pretty terrible job. Of yeah, we haven't been too good at that tonight. He's smiling on me. Uh, coming up on our cave. We're heading over to a suspicious person checking corridors. We just came from that last one. There's just a lot, a lot of car door checking. Yeah, good idea to keep your car doors locked. There really is a lot of this going on. We're People just go car to car, looking for open doors. They go in and take anything that's clear. Anything that's uh, laying around in the car. Zero five one zero seven. And a lot of times they take the car. Indeed. Stay out too long. I heard Pat, Pat's gotten out of shape for this drive because he's yawning. I got a brand new mom too right here with the back seat. 
minutes. I'll go as long as you can go. No, I shouldn't say that because I think you can. I think you can go 24/7. I sleep. I sleep really fast. 21 6 5 7 GSC. That was always a good habit to pick up as a cop, being able to sleep fast. 205 County Road D Bravo 28. According to our GSC in the parking garage, a uh, male was having a dispute with a female. Was trying to leave. Earlier, the caller saw the male trying to pull the female's pants down. She was trying to get away. Door handles. Well, that's the one Two black there. males, black female. Yep. Unknown description for the fourth person. Group was seen northbound in the alley towards Hyson. Doesn't look like they gained access to any of the vehicles. Request an area check. That's what we were just checking out, but we didn't want to tell St. Paul just they don't Point come up here. Because if the TNT is still on the floor, what's well, the cops? Can you see if that's the uh, perfect thing? They're obviously still there somewhere. Yeah, they're still in the neighborhood. Copy, okay, clarification. Uh, the call was just updated. Uh, thing with the male party is a Sioux Sandoval. Female is the uh, 321 in the squads in the area. 321 in the squads in the area. I think this is how we get in there, right? I think so. I don't know exactly. This is I don't know. The the Address down here in Wilson. This one I think is a dead end. We got to go down to the next one. And squad three, one go through. Uh, three sixty. Hmm. Three six one. Yeah, might go through. It's Conway. We are in the southwest corner of three six one. Is everything all right, ma'am? No, I appreciate that. That's yeah. good. Yeah, We're good. just checking on you. Oh, all right. Sorry Thanks. About that. Thank you. 382. 382. Any other squads for 2 o'clock, Yoji? 383 is the honor. We turn down here, right? Yep. Thanks. Got yeah. the squads out here. <laughs> we'll you get there. Turn down there. We'll get there. It's the wrong block. I was supposed to be wearing a black jacket. Has a backpack. Was last seen sitting behind a car. Uh, Seventy-one thirty-one. Copy additional squads for us. 0200 DOT, 171. Okay, Eagle Eye. 712. 712. 712. Couldn't say if we had a car too long in this weather. Wouldn't think so. 184. 182 and 184. But I'm wrong before. Any additional? 164. One six four and eight additional. Have a good night, one forty seven. Is there a parking lot on the other side or not? I'm not sure. One two nine. One two nine. I don't think so. Copy. Uh, 
copy that message? Can you start me a call for Haha ha and Hamlin? And Ron? I'll check it out. Alright, so what do we got here? Copy at 147. How's it going? 182 on MOT. You see any suspicious characters copy out here? No. Okay. Okay. There was a guy with a backpack checking car doors. <laughs> you know, it says WB lot. Maybe that means West Back Lot. Well, let's see, so we can move around. Check this lot out, too. This guy's, this truck's running. Is there a curb there? Am I good? You're good. Let's see what this, this looks like. <laughs> 320. How you doing? 320. Happy holidays. Happy holidays hey, to you, too. It's a good one. Yes, it is. <laughs> Y'all having fun out here tonight? Indeed. Number 263. Yeah, we had some chocolate Twinkies. I've been with water. I don't know. Shit. Oh, You're with some hot right sauce. Here? Oh, you're cold sauce. Yeah. Oh, there you go. I can't get nobody. You can't eat anybody. Sir. Okay. Important question for you. Crystal hot sauce or Frank's Red Hot? Frank's Red Hot. Oh, oh man. man. I'm a crystal. I, I, I used to be one. Like, you older. Hot stuff. See <laughs> then. I give you that little buzz. There you go. <laughs> Take care. Okay. UPD 1201 Jackson Street. I also had a backpack. Last Jackson. I was about to offer him a box of, no a box of donuts, but <laughs> maybe it's too much for one guy. 225. They just dispatched this. Update and end location is going to be Jefferson and 35. Must be cleared, assistant, move 24. 33. Where's the alarm sound coming from? 383. Copy. 150. I can't tell. You know, there's GOA with three people around here. It'd be hard to just... What, the, what is big. up with all the cars running and people uh, in the lot? Copy. 2160 Margaret Street on a welfare check. Secondhand info reference. The Comps neighbor... There was a car alarm, hit but... by her boyfriend. Oops, in the I need a... Plug. Can I borrow that one? Yeah. Comp request to stay anonymous. Request welfare check. No further information. Uh, and I'm sorry, the name was Samantha Palmer on the uh, welfare check recipient. That was three, three, two, three, three. The alarm was that guy working on his car. Three, two, one, mm -hmm. That one's the one. We'll go back to Wilson. Well, we haven't seen anybody carrying a backpack. No. Nope. If they're laying back of the car, they're probably cutting off catalytic converters. <laughs> Copy. 23624. A lot on the other side. This would be west, anyhow. Mm -hmm. What, 2165? Tom's phone is not accepting coming calls. Okay, we're going to go around the Twenty-one six five, Logan. All right, we're going to go to the south side. Copy, checking the south side.
think anybody's still here. No. I'll let St. Paul take another look at it, but... Looks pretty vacant. I'm not feeling like we had a ton going on tonight. No, but uh Clear report with Central and Ridge County. Copy 153. Well, let's swing through Maplewood a little bit, huh? Yeah. That gentleman might get out there to Maplewood. You know, as soon as we get to Maplewood, something's going to happen back here. Yeah, you might be right, but no. <laughs> Just... Oh, Wait, one sec, though. If we go into the garage, the uh, van just left, but we couldn't get a plate on it. That's a cutter of me. We got into the oh, okay. garage. Certain fan leaves. Black me, Van, that's all we've got. Seven on Hudson Road, apartment two. Seven. Assisting by 320. Hudson Road? Find out. Don't have the area. Right, your first class County's on a call at 205 County Road B2, calls Merck CSC. One, two, four. Says that the male was having a dispute with a female relative and had earlier tried to pull her pants down. She was listening, trying to get away. Um, no description on the party. However, there was a black minivan that left the scene. No plate info or direction of travel. Information at 155. Clear. Towards Rice Street from the Grand Prix apartment. So let's see if we can help out. 2160 clear, 6-3 slow. It's a ways away, but... 
Oh, they got him. 2172, I copy. Canceling 10 1, 1 in custody. Oh. Good job. It's one of the county cars, right? What's that? He must have been hiding out in a garage. Yeah. So it sounds like they caught the criminal sexual conduct uh, suspect. There's someone at the front door trying to break in. They did say the male was knocking. Someone's so not calls they, popping up in the I know. Oh, it's kind of almost hard to keep them straight. Copy, Ralph. 5183, Tango. I'm, I'm solid here for a while. I'm all Mountain Dew'd up. 320, I'll be clear. 85 Tango, go for both. Motel 6, 2300, Cleveland Avenue, room 216, uh, Wild Jack. Cops requesting to speak with officers. He's worried about leaving. He's paranoid. He has a head injury and doesn't feel safe. Hey, that he hasn't slept in four days. Uh, comps wearing a black sweatshirt. Now we got a call on the east. Yeah, I want 59. Where was that? I don't know. No history at this address. I'll find out. Okay. Squad 300. 300. Can you please call data? Copy. Thank you. At 2 o'clock. Right where we were. Yeah. Yeah. So the Wilson call, whoever's on Wilson, probably right on top of it. And 320. I'm on a couple blocks here. Tell the town to stay in your house. Clear right. Yeah, be 320 out in a couple. Have the comp stay in the house. Suspect still on the phone at the front door. Comp and father are inside. And we just 
had the constant day inside. yelling and acting more aggressive. It's interesting. Cumberland of Maryland had 203. I think he's right. I think we turn here. But that's street sign say there, Pat. Yeah, we're not quite far enough. 1395. Yeah, we're good. Where are we going? 1415. Margaret's all right. Yeah. This is a beach, right? Yep. 9174. 9174. 9174. Six three one one detained. Code four. Is that them? Yep. Six three one. I copy. One detained. Code four at two zero four. Fifty one eighty four Tango. Cut me as a third of that. Watch out, sir. Oh, they've got the suspect in custody here. I thought the dog was on the suspect, but apparently <laughs> the, the dog is just barking at the suspect. Nice work, guys. Copy, code 4, 205. 205. 2166. 2166. Change of plans. In route to Regents. In route to Regents, that's all. So got word that they uh, they recovered the suspect's gun oh, in the Brooklyn good. Park officer shooting. Awesome. Awesome. Did they say where they found it? Was it out there in an article search? Or? It sounds minister. like from the article search, yeah. Terrific. Yeah. That's great news. Two two one. Two two one. Let's go, man. Let's go, Hal. Three two nine. I copy your route to the noise complaint at ten thirty five Bradley. Two o seven. Is it after two o'clock? Yes, it is. What the heck? <laughs> and 314 is en route to another noise disturbance, 2257 4th Street East, at 207. At 207. Well, we'll make a stroll through Maplewood before we wrap it up. Huh? 
Your daughter working tonight or not? I am not sure. I can't keep a schedule up there. Security report. Copy two oh seven. Something going on at ten in the morning. I can't remember what it is. You have something going on? Oh no, I don't have anything going on. It's that listing session. I won't be listening. Oh. I'll be sleeping. <laughs> Did we reboot anyhow? Do you remember? Um, 11? Three hours and 18 minutes ago. So. Well, that's really smart of you to keep track like that. <laughs> well, I guess on Monday we find out what the governor's plan is. Sports, bars, restaurants, holidays. I have no idea what it is, but we probably should talk about that stabbing incident over in Hudson, St. Croix County. Oh, yeah. Because those parties did, they were visiting Hudson because of, well, it's the only place open, I guess. And, um,. Hudson police were able to, well, they worked with a lot of St. Paul Metro agencies, including ours, to arrest the, especially Blaine PD, arrest the suspects up in Blaine on that stabbing. Pretty, pretty fast, good work on that. Yeah, apparently our guys were helping on surveillance and they saw them washing the blood off the van. Really? Yeah. Lane got a search, or Hudson got a search warrant. They did, went in and arrested the parties, and one thing led to another. But stabbing death has been solved. Contact room 216. Contact room 216. Zero Squad 214. Yes. 214. She is working. 7 Copy 211. 220 clear as well. Copy 211. Maplewood and North St. Paul, there's a Dodge Charger going about uh, 90 to 100 miles an hour up uh, Lakewood. I think it's probably north of Larkander right now.
make wood, that's the same as uh, McKnight. Looks like it. Okay. Those are charger. I think those are charger tail lights. That one's certainly not traveling very fast. Out of St. Paul, the liquid in Maryland, dark color charger that's going about 90 to 100 miles an hour. Sounds like north. Possibly should be north of north by now. At 2:13. Are you initiated a traffic stop there? It uh, pulled over here. We're checking out with it. Three, two, one, second. Three, two, one, Kevin. Charger, they must have meant Durango or. It's got that long. Three to one, Cutter. We gotta give these guys three, a three, brief about that. <laughs> three, three, you can clear it as GOA with three to one. And you can send me that TLC. Now, normally we don't razz guys, but younger guys, we gotta, we gotta got razz. I, I've got my line ready. Oh, do you? Yeah. Say, sir, sir. Must be one of those transformers. What's that? <laughs> yeah. Uh, switched on us as we're moving. We just, tab, we don't we give you a little grief. Tail, you know? tail lights, right, they yeah, look like it. I got these 324 and 383. Was he doing 100? 1726. Uh, he was going pretty fast. Pretty By the time we got up to him, he slowed down. So. What, what's he say? Referencing friend of the mother that was refusing to leave, possibly under the influence. <laughs> you good though? Yeah, we're good. Thank All right, you. thanks. Have a good one, guys. Very yeah. nice. There's an inside a vehicle there, a Dodge pickup that was parked in front of the address. Time delay of her original call was 17 minutes midnight. <laughs> I, I think the transformer line was a good one. I don't think he thought it was as funny as we did, though. That's all right. city of Maplewood, right on the border of Maplewood, North St. Paul right now. Well, somebody agrees. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they said Transformers going on the next bingo card. <laughs> <laughs> Is that O'Keefe? Is that the O'Keefe's or not? No. about three one four. Uh, yeah, we're sorry. We weren't our normal upbeat selves tonight. But we just got a little bit... Uh, Can you double check that? Like, we're just glad that officer is not... Yeah. I'm sorry, can you go again? What? You double check the license plate. Oh, open, that up an open house sign, I think. Oh. Oh, 
Yeah, it should come back to a yep. Lincoln SUV of some sort. Edmond Avenue. Caller's parents are arguing it's possibly physical. Comp is 16 years old. And the advice, Comp thinks her mom has a gun because she heard her father tell her mom to put the gun down. Oh. Mother's name is Lauren, a mixed female, 36 years old, 5'3", heavy set. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And she want you copy as well. <coughs> two on affirmative. Thank you, 218. One, two, three. Go on. Paraphrase, still working on your results. I just finished writing clear reports. March 2, 119, 117, and 129. Copy, 218. Well, as crazy as it is, this night is pretty typical of the midnights I worked many years, you know, we just, there might be something, there might not be. We you just, never know. You know, you just, sometimes you just <coughs> sure. Sure, what? drive around waiting for... I'm sorry, did you say you still have the call on the line? One, two, two, one, call. But at two o'clock in the morning, Eighty percent looks like the color is still on the line. I don't know if there's heat coming up or your old light is burning me up. Uh oh. No, the old light's over here. On the plus side, I don't have any reports to write in the morning. Well, there you go. Thank you, Nick. I needed uh, I needed to hear. What did he say? He said, well, at least you won't have any paperwork in the morning. 4327. <laughs> May have spoken too soon, though. The night's Sorry, not over. Here we go. Oh, there, please. Oh. Oh. Thank you, 220. Boy, it sure is quiet. I think we should head for the barn. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Did you like to just confirm with the cops? We're, we're going to have to make, make this up to you. So here's what we're going to do. 221 copy. An update. Parents are currently downstairs in the living room. The father do, is still yelling at the mother. We're going to do a daytime. Father has been drinking. A daytime. Uh, <laughs> 21. We gotta talk to these three young men that are walking down Wiper Avenue at 2.30 in the morning. Okay. Oh, they just crossed the street on me. Buggers. <laughs> pretty young. <coughs> Technically, there still is a curfew. However, yeah, yeah, yeah. it's rarely, if at all, enforced. Yeah. 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 What's going on? Hi. How's everybody? Good. Just checking out, making sure it looks like we got some adults here, huh? Yeah. 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 All right, very good. Have a good night. You thank, thank you. Thank you.
I thought they were all kids. One wasn't. The other two were adults. They're out. I didn't even want to ask what they're doing walking around. Disregarding, it looks like Adam's side-by-side. Duplex unit is on the right. That's no certainly... further mentions of the gun at this time. Everybody has a right to be out there. Yeah. 222. Jersey Mike's many times. I love Jersey Mike's. Yep, that's one of my son's favorite. Slice the meat right there in front of you. Yeah, well, I just pick it up. But yeah, they 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 they, uh, they make a good sandwich. You ever get that hot red relish on it? I don't, but I you, you know, should. I'm gonna get that turkey tom or whatever it's called, right? Is that what's that the name of it? It's just a turkey sandwich. Oh, okay. I Tommy, usually get like the, the, the Italian. They have monthly for other spots and all for Chicago. Happy 223. Strange, huh? Yeah. Very strange. We're out by Maplewood Mall in <coughs> Maplewood, Minnesota. Earthbound and Whiteboard. We'll do a loop around Maplewood Mall, make sure everything's safe there, and then we're going to sign off for the night. But we're going to do an, an afternoon sometime in the daylight here this next week. An update from the comp. Comp does not good. hear any further arguing. Might actually time. be busier during the day. <laughs> But we'll find out, like I said, Monday what the governor's plan is. Yep. So I, I think originally he was going through the 18th, right? Yeah, originally. 60 Kellogg Boulevard East and Squad 223, can you assist? Ran into a lot of nice people. Appreciate all your positive support and feedback over the last four or five months. It uh, means a lot to us. Absolutely. Very, very appreciative. It's just hard to thank you directly with messages and stuff. Well, Monday morning, I'm going to meet with the new special agent in charge of the Minneapolis, uh, Minnesota FBI office. We've got a new, new agent here in the last couple months. Looking forward to that. Copy, With the new president, not sure if there'll be a new marshal and a new U.S. attorney or not, but always appreciated Erica McDonald, our U.S. attorney. She just does an awesome job. Erica McDonald is amazing. She was an awesome judge, too, awesome prosecutor, and know if there's a chance she can stay on but very very talented person yeah, I, I hope so Sharon Levinsky is still the marshal right she does a great job too So we are probably getting close to the end here for tonight. Yeah, sorry there wasn't more, but you did get breaking news about the, you know, officer getting shot. Thank God he's going to make it. It's not life-threatening. And 221 update for the TC. Looks like parties are arguing again. Gonna finish up here across the street from my go to place for take home food right now. Outback. Ah. Filet. 
a little uh, Victoria's yeah. filet. Yeah. Or they chicken, the chicken on the barbie. Yeah. They put out some decent food. There's another restaurant or something going in next between them and Chili's and uh at Jake's here? I haven't been there for a while. I think is that closed now or not? Yeah, it's closed now. That's the place that uh the seafood boil. Cajun seafood boil place is going. My mom's favorite fettuccine Alfredo here at the Olive Garden. All right, well, let's. Uh, there's the chilies in the background. Chilies to go, and the signs out. All we see is the S. <laughs> really, thanks so much for uh, hanging with us. Sorry, there wasn't more going on tonight, but you got a little bit of flavor of what it's normally like. Patrick? Thank you for being with us. As uh, Bob said, we're going to be here uh, one weekday coming up here this week. We don't know which one yet. But uh, if you subscribe to the YouTube or follow the Live on Patrol Facebook page, you'll get a notification when we go live. Thanks again for being with us. Thank you especially for all the good wishes and prayers for the Brooklyn Park officer. Uh, thank, uh, thank God he's going to be okay.